Hello and welcome back. My name is Scorpios, and I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I am back here this week from the Mysomnia SMP server with another episode. And guys, I do not actually have a lot planned for today's episode. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that have been happening here around my base. So yeah, things have been pretty busy. And as you can see around here, a lot of things have changed since the year is almost over i think this would be a perfect opportunity for us to go back and take a look at everything that we have accomplished during this year here on this server so without further ado let's jump right into our video for today so in my last episode i um, started digging out this area i turned this uh, whole mountain area into a flat land the area here look a bit more natural. Uh, I should probably uh, add some more grass here just to make this area look even better. But as you can see here, I am still in the process of finishing the landscaping project here. <laughs> and of course, if you come down here, this whole area is uh, hollow on the inside. So yeah, so I do not have any plan to build anything down here so as you can see here i have been doing quite a bit of a building here in my base um so on live stream as well i built uh, this area here and this nice little tower here as well which is still work in progress so i still need to figure out a way ouch i still need to figure out a way to decorate the inside so that it does not look as much like a hollow shell but I think I have some ideas and I am going to keep working on this area after I come back from a nice Christmas break. And speaking of Christmas, one of the latest projects that I am working on right now, which I was in a bit of a rush to finish, but I, uh, I was able to finish it in time, is this Christmas tree. Uh, as you can see, this is not a Christmas tree in a traditional sense. But I was able to get it done together the weekend right before Christmas and I am very happy with how it turned out. Yeah, so um, I built this whole thing in about a day. Uh, it was quite an accomplishment for me and I think, I think this Christmas tree is going to stay here even after Christmas is over because I just really love how this Christmas tree turned out. So yeah, I had a lot of fun building this tree and I am actually going to show you guys a quick time lapse of how I built this whole thing up. So as you can see here, when I first started working on this project, this did not look like how it turned out. Uh, I started by placing down a bunch of scaffolding blocks, which are these uh, netherrack blocks that you are seeing here. So I went on an end raid um, in preparation of this building project and I got myself a couple of stacks of end rods. So here, as you can see, I am just placing down these end rods upside down in a somewhat random pattern to make it look a, a bit more natural, which, which I think it turned out pretty well. And after that, uh, as you can see here, what I did is that I went around and scattered in some colored blocks. Uh, so here I have a mix of lapis blocks, uh, redstone blocks, and emerald blocks. And after that, I also put in some colored mini blocks. So, so here on my Somnia server, we do have the data pack that gives you those colorful mini blocks, which you can trade with wandering traders. And after everything is in place, the next thing I did is to get rid of the netherrack blocks and someone on live stream also suggested adding a skirt to this Christmas tree. So I went ahead and actually worked on one. Uh, but as you can see here, this is not a Christmas tree skirt in your traditional sense. So I dug out a hole and I lined the walls here with some black stone. Here, as you can see, giving it a well-defined boundary. So that, guys, is a quick time lapse of how I built this Christmas tree project. Uh, and as you can see, I have loaded up a shader to show you the full beauty of this thing. And off camera, another thing that I also did is that I went to the beacon shop here on the server and I got myself four beacons. And when you are looking at this thing at night, this is just majestic. So I love it a lot. Um, 
but I think we are getting some mobs spawning in this area. So yeah, so um, so I do not have this area of my base light up uh, at night. This area turns into a bit of a mob farm. And during the process of building this Christmas tree, I actually died quite many times to zombies and creepers as well. So yeah, so I am going to get myself to safety and I will be right back. And another project that I have been working on here uh, in my base are these new buildings. Uh, so as you can see here, there is this building right here. And I have another group of buildings that are coming up on this side as well. So this is going to be a very busy part of my base. But right now, these buildings are actually just empty shells. If, so if you come back over here, <laughs> there is literally nothing behind these buildings. But eventually, I do have some plans for this area. Uh, unfortunately, um, I am going away for Christmas and I will not be able to keep working on this part of my base until after New Year. So yeah, you will be receiving more updates from this area of my base. Those are actually the only uh, updates that I have here from my survival base. So yeah, it has been a few months since I joined my Somnia server and this has been quite a bit of progress that I have made. And for the rest of this episode, guys, I actually do not have other plans. So, so yeah, if you guys want to stick around, I was actually just going to show you guys some of the other projects that I have worked on so far in this season. And before we actually hop over to the shopping district, I'm actually taking a short break here. In this nether hub area above bedrock in the nether, I wanted to take a look at my mailbox to see if I have new things delivered. And guys, it does look like we have a Christmas gift box. So guys, this is really, really fantastic. And I think this is one of the greatest things about playing on an SMP server. The people on the server are super nice and they are super friendly people to play with. Yeah, so I am having quite a lot of fun playing here on this server and I really, really appreciate my server mates. They are awesome people and you should totally check out all of them. So down below in, in the video description, I am going to leave all of their YouTube channels and you should go ahead and check them out. So that was a bit of a shout out to my fantastic server mates and I also wanted to take some time to appreciate each and every one of you for being here for watching my videos and thank you for sticking around. And right now I am actually here in the shopping district and right behind me is the town hall that is at the center of the shopping district. And this is quite a magnificent building. And over here from on top of the town hall, you can actually get a panorama of the shopping district. So this is quite a big shopping district. Uh, this area has grown quite a lot. So over here, we do have some new shops that are popping up. So we have always Aelin Spell Hunt. Yeah, and over here, we also have some new shops that are popping up, which is nice. And so far in this season, I actually do not have a lot of shops built in this shopping district. So my two main shops are here uh, in this corner of the shopping district and they are very nicely tucked away nice next to each other, which is nice. So I'm gonna come down here and take a look. So the green store here is my very first shop here on the server and it has been generating quite a lot of diamonds for me. And next door here, we have uh, the haunted house, which is still under construction. So I am not going to go into too much detail. And over here, guys, we have one of the newest shops here that I have built on the server, which is right here uh, in my garden area that uh, I purchased from Always Alien a long time ago. So yeah, so on live stream, I also built up this uh, little building here which I named it uh, the world's smallest shop. So this shop is actually a mini shop for selling mini blocks. So as you can see here, I am selling mini blocks and with at the price of one diamond for four blocks, there has not been a lot of business going on here. And I think I'll try to think of ways to promote this shop to let people know that we have a new shop here. 
So that is actually all I have prepared for you guys today. Yeah, this is this is definitely a shorter episode, but I just wanted to show you guys some of the things that have been happening here. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.